Hello everyone. This is the fifth question of exercise 8.1 and in this question we have to check whether this 3 is the root of this equation or not. Now you can see that this is not given as a proper quadratic equation. Now we have to make this as a proper quadratic equation. For this we have to square both the sides. So on squaring both the sides this will be a square that means x square minus 4x plus 3. This will be b square that means plus x square minus 9 plus 2 a is under root x square minus 4x plus 3 and under root x square minus 9 equals to and the right hand side will be after squaring 4x square minus 14x plus 16. Now, you must be thinking how to solve this. To solve this, first of all, we will factorize these quadratic equations. Now, to factorize this, x square minus 4x plus 3, that will be x square minus as it is. The factors will be 3 plus 1, x plus 3. So that will be x square minus 3x minus x plus 3 x common x minus 3 minus 1 common x minus 3 so that will be x minus 3 and x minus 1 now the factors of x square minus 9 will be x plus 3 and x minus 3 because this is a square minus b square and that is a plus b a minus b now we'll solve this this will be 2x square minus 4x 3 plus 2 is 5 and 5 minus 9 is minus 4 plus 2 under root x minus 3 x minus 1 and under root x plus 3 x minus 3 and here it will be the same that is 4x square minus 14x plus 16 now We'll shift these there that side. So this will be 2. Now how to multiply this? In this type of questions means in which this is there. Here the root remains as it is. And the terms inside the root gets multiplied. So this will be x minus 3. x minus 1. x plus 3. And x minus 3. And in, on this side it will be 4x square minus 14x plus 16 minus 2x square plus 4x plus 4. Now, we can see that here it is x minus 3 and also x minus 3. So this will be 2 under root the whole square of x minus 3, x minus 1, x plus 3. And it will be equals to 4x square minus 2x square, 2x square minus 14x plus 4x minus 10x and 16 plus 4 that is 20. Now this can cancel this out. So it will be like x minus 3. It will come out of the bracket means this root out of this root under root x minus 1 x plus 3. And this 2 went in division, so it will be equals to x square minus 5x plus 10. Now, this will come in the denominator and if you want we can again root this or we can directly substitute the value. We will substitute 3. On substituting 3, it will... On substituting 3, the left hand side will be equals to 0, but the right hand side will be equals to 9 minus 15 plus 10. That is 9 equals to 4. So they both are not equal. Therefore, 3 is not the root of this given equation. Or if you want, in some schools, there is, 
you can directly substitute the value of 3 if left hand side equals to right hand side then it is the root of the equation if not then it is not the root of the equation this is how we can solve this question thank you